All right, let's talk about video game enemies for a second. I want you to forget everything you think you know about how they work. We are right on the edge of a massive shift where the AI doesn't just follow a pre-written script, it actually learns from you. And no, this isn't some far off sci-fi dream. It's happening right now in the game Ark Raiders and honestly, it's about to change everything. Think about it. You know that one move you always pull in a shooter? That little right hand peek you always do or that specific dodge you rely on every single time? Well, what if the game started to notice that? What if the AI learned your little habits and used your own predictability as a weapon against you? That's the wild idea we're diving into today. So, to really get why this is such a huge deal, we've got to take a quick look back. I'm talking about the enemies we've been fighting for decades. Because, for the most part, they haven't really been artificially intelligent. They've been more, well, artificially predictable. For years and years, the AI in our favorite games has been, you know, a pretty clever trick. It's basically a puppet. It's just following a script that says, hey, if the player walks over here, then start shooting or if my health gets below 20%, I'm gonna run and hide. It's, it's just a flowchart, right? It's not a thinking being. And that right there, that is the massive difference we're talking about. On one side, you have the old way, the scripted enemy that just follows its programming. But on the other, you've got an opponent that actually learns from experience, it adapts, it makes its own calls. It's like the difference between fighting a puppet and fighting a real predator. So how do you make that jump, you know, from a simple scripted puppet to a thinking hunting machine? Well, the answer is a piece of tech that, believe it or not, you're interacting with pretty much every single day and you might not even know it. It's called machine learning. And here's the best way to think about it. Instead of giving a kid a rule book on how to play chess, what if you just had them watch thousands and thousands of games? Eventually, they'd start to see patterns, they'd get the strategies, and they'd learn to play all on their own. That is exactly what's going on here. And yeah, it's the same powerful tech behind your Netflix recommendations and your phone's facial recognition. So how does it actually work in the game? It's this constant three-step dance. First, the AI is just watching you. It's gathering data on everything you do, how you move, how you shoot, everything. Then, step two, it starts crunching that data, looking for your habits, your little weaknesses, and finally, part three, this is the fun part, it changes its own strategy to totally exploit what it just learned about you. Now let's get specific. Let's pull back the curtain on Ark Raiders and see exactly how the folks at Embark Studios are making this happen. Because this is where all that cool sounding theory becomes a, well, a pretty terrifying reality for the person holding the controller. This right here is the aha moment. Okay, imagine you have a habit. Every time an enemy shoots, you dodge to the right. It's just muscle memory. A normal old school AI would just keep shooting where you were, but this new AI, it learns. It sees that pattern, it starts to anticipate your move, and it begins aiming where you're going to be. It'll catch you mid-dodge. That is an absolute game changer. And you've got to understand, this kind of intelligence isn't just switched on, it's forged. The developers have talked about this brutal, years-long process. When they started, the AI was a complete mess. It could barely even walk properly. It took millions upon millions of failures for it to just learn the basics, and then millions more for it to start developing the kinds of advanced strategies that could actually outsmart a person. It's just an incredible testament to learning by trial and error on a truly epic scale. Okay, so the tech is awesome. We get it. But what does it actually feel like? What does this mean for you, sitting on your couch, controller in hand, trying to play this game? The early feedback from players who have gone up against this AI, well, it says it all. They went in thinking it would be business as usual, but what they found was something else entirely. According to the feedback, players were, and I quote, stunned by how quickly the enemies adapted and punished predictable strategies. It was a complete shock to the system. And this is the real takeaway. All of a sudden, every single firefight is a brand new puzzle. The enemy is reacting to you, not some script. Those old, tired patterns are just gone. And in their place is this dynamic, unpredictable battlefield that forces you, I mean, it forces you to think on your feet and constantly evolve. The days of mastering one repetitive strategy and just coasting, yeah, those are over. Let's be really clear here, this is a huge moment for gaming. 
Machine learning has kind of been humming along in the background for years, but this is one of the first times we're seeing it take center stage, directly impacting the moment-to-moment -moment gameplay. It is a bold, bold step into the future. And all of this leads to a pretty fascinating and maybe, maybe a little chilling question. As this technology gets better and better, what happens when our digital opponents just never stop learning? What happens when they learn faster than we do and they're always one step ahead? The future of gaming might just be a lot more challenging than any of us ever imagined.